Welcome to Pit 2. This is our Iron Age site. It's one of several we have where your students can come and discover where science and history come together in archaeology. Here in Pit 2, students have been making some interesting discoveries, like this column furnace. It's an ancient way of making iron. They've also uncovered artifacts such as these. They're 3,000-year-old potsherds from the Ammonite culture in what is now the Kingdom of Jordan. But we're not in the Kingdom of Jordan. We're at La Sierra University in Riverside, California. Here in La Sierra Pit 1, students discover archaeology a little bit closer to home. Many of the artifacts are 100 years old and were discovered during the development of Petco Park, San Diego. Some of the artifacts found during the original excavation were kept for a future study and some were put on display at the park itself and then some were put here for the students to rediscover. The program here at La Sierra can accommodate up to two classrooms at the same time. But this is only one of four locations where your students can come out and experience one of our archaeology adventures. Heritage Education Programs has used the excitement of archaeological adventures and discoveries to teach concepts in history, science, language arts, and mathematics using standard rich lessons. Our excavation field trip program is called Archaeology Adventure and it is for grades four and up. It starts out with hands-on preparation lessons that are either held in your classroom or during our field school at one of our simulated archaeological sites. As part of our preparation lessons, students work with real 100-year-old artifacts to teach concepts of observation inference, context, conservation, and using primary historic documents. At all our program sites, students excavate, screen for smaller artifacts, map the artifacts that they find using ordinate pairs, and describe the soil they are excavating in. Archaeology is not about the things we find. It's about what we find out. So, after excavating, students measure and record their finds, give them catalog numbers. They do a more in-depth recording on selected artifacts, including context and soil conditions. Then they can share their findings with fellow students and come up with a hypothesis as to what people were doing at the site. In addition to our sites in La Sierra, we have a site in Apple Valley at the Lewis Center for Educational Research, and it is based on the excavations at Jamestown, Virginia. Students discover early American history and science as they uncover features based on the 1608 glassworks along with reproduction of 17th century artifacts. The site was created with the help of the Association for Preservation of Virginia Antiquity and the Eastern National Parks Association. At Lewis Center, we are also building a new site that will simulate the excavation of a Roman glassworks. This will allow us to have two classrooms participate in our archaeology adventure at the same time. At the Grove School in Redlands, students are excavating a site based on a farmstead in the Roman Empire. Here, we are excavating the foundation of a structure and a Roman statue. Come to this site and have your students discover evidence of day-to-day -day life 1900 years ago. We also have a site at the Outdoor Education and Science Experience Camp in Lake Arrowhead. The Archaeology Adventure Program is aligned with California State Education Standards and Frameworks and coincides with STEM objectives. This is more than a field trip. It is a hands-on field school where your students will experience the discipline of science, the excitement of discovery, and have fun in the process.